It is important to expect nothing, to take every experience, including the negative ones, as merely steps on the path, and to proceed. The quieter you become, the more you can hear. The most exquisite paradox. As soon as you give it all up, you can have it all. As long as you want power, you can't have it. The minute you don't want power, you'll have more than you ever dreamed possible. I would like my life to be a statement of love and compassion, and where it isn't, that's where my work lies. In most of our human relationships, we spend much of our time reassuring one another that our costumes of identity are on straight. The heart surrenders everything to the moment. The mind judges and holds back. Treat everyone you meet like God in drag. Your problem is you are too busy holding on to your unworthiness. The most important aspect of love is not in giving or the receiving. It's in the being. When I need love from others, or need to give love to others, I'm caught in an unstable situation. Being in love, rather than giving or taking love, is the only thing that provides stability. Being in love means seeing the beloved all around me. As long as you have certain desires about how it ought to be, you can't see how it is. What you meet in another person is the projection of your own level of evolution. Suffering is part of our training program for becoming wise. The spiritual journey is individual, highly personal. It can't be organized or regulated. It isn't true that everyone should follow one path. Listen to your own truth. Everything changes once we identify with being the witness to the story instead of the actor in it. Only that in you which is me can hear what I'm saying. We are all affecting the world every moment, whether we mean to or not. Our actions and states of mind matter because we are so deeply interconnected with one another. Let's trade in all our judging for appreciating. Let's lay down our righteousness and just be together. A feeling of aversion or attachment towards something is your clue that there's work to be done. The next message you need is always right where you are. I can do nothing for you but work on myself. You can do nothing for me but work on yourself. The game is not about becoming somebody. It's about becoming nobody. Every religion is the product of the conceptual mind attempting to describe the mystery. If you think you're free, there's no escape possible. I'm not interested in being a lover. I'm interested 
in only being love. Learn to watch your drama unfold while at the same time knowing you are more than your drama. It's only when caterpillarness is done that one becomes a butterfly. That again is part of this paradox. You cannot rip away caterpillarness. The whole trip occurs in an unfolding process of which we have no control. Information is just bits of data. Knowledge is putting them together. Wisdom is transcending them. We are here to awaken from the illusion of separateness. The resistance to the unpleasant situation is the root of suffering. It's all real and it's all illusory. That's awareness. Our whole spiritual transformation brings us to the point where we realize that in our own being, we are enough. Suffering is the sandpaper of our incarnation. It does its work of shaping us. The ego is an exquisite instrument. Enjoy it. Use it. Just don't get lost in it. By acting compassionately, by helping to restore justice and to encourage peace, we are acknowledging that we are all part of one another. You and I are the force for transformation in the world. We are the consciousness that will define the nature of the reality we are moving into. When somebody provokes your anger, the only reason you get angry is because you're holding on to how you think something is supposed to be. You're denying how it is then you see it's the expectations of your own mind that are creating your own hell. As one individual changes, the system changes.